Beneath the forest floor lies a world alien to human experience. A world of perpetual night. A world inhabited by a multitude of organisms, many of which never see the light of day. While some of the larger soil animals, such as earthworms, may be familiar, the majority are small, blind creatures, unfamiliar to all but the scientists who study them. Two groups of animals are especially numerous, springtails, which are primitive insects, and mites, which are distant relatives of spiders. Other kinds of soil animals include false scorpions, millipedes, centipedes, bristletails, and bark lice. Most soil animals are small and do not have projections, such as long legs, antennae, or wings, to hamper their movement through the tunnels. Others, like the rove beetle, which spends the majority of its life underground, but has retained the ability to fly, has a long, thin body and small wing covers, which allow it to move through the soil with ease. Soil animals can be roughly divided into two groups. Those that eat other animals, carnivores, and those that eat plants, herbivores. Carnivores actively hunt their prey, which they must capture, subdue, and eat. They can usually be recognized by their long legs and prominent eyes. Herbivores, on the other hand, must avoid being eaten. Some do this by wearing heavy armor or protective plates of wax. Others avoid capture by more active means. It is important to realize that most of the biological activity in a forest occurs underground. As you look at this greatly magnified section of soil, keep in mind that you are seeing only a minute fraction of the animals that live there.